Hey guys welcome to Learn Ado. today we will be studying about humanistic psychology. Humanistic psychology focuses on uniqueness of a person. It emphasizes to to enhance the human qualities of choice, personal growth and psychological health. Abraham Maslow become founder of this school of psychology be providing a theory of psychological health predicated on fulfilling innate human needs and priority. Humanistic psychology rejects psychoanalytic and behavioral views and emphasizes a positive view of human nature and also human inherent drive towards self-actualization. Humanism also suggests that people possess personal agency. Some of the ways that humanism is applied within the field of psychology include, humanistic therapy personal development social changes. Some of the major ideas and concepts that emerged as a result of the humanist movement include an emphasis on things such as, client-centered therapy free will self-actualization hierarchy of needs unconditional positive regard. Client-centered therapy is non-directive form of talk therapy. In this approach you act as an equal partner in a therapy process. Self-actualization is often described as the full development of one's capabilities, involving an appreciation for and complete participation. It is an individual process that differs from one person to the next. And it does not correlate with age and gender. Maslow's hierarchy of needs as a motivational theory in psychology comprising a five-tier model of human needs. 1. Physiological needs. These are biological requirements for human survival, for example air, food, drink, shelter, clothing, warmth, sex, sleep. 2. Safety needs. Once an individual's physiological needs are satisfied, the needs for security and safety become salient. These needs can be fulfilled by the family and society. 3. Love and belongingness needs. The third level of human needs is social and involves feelings of belongingness. Belongingness refers to a human emotional need for interpersonal relationships, affiliating, connectedness, and being part of a group. 4. Esteem needs are the fourth level in Maslow's hierarchy and includes self worth, accomplishment, and respect. Maslow classified esteem needs into two categories, I, esteem for oneself, dignity, achievement, mastery, independence, and, 2, the desire for reputation or respect from others. 5. Self-actualization needs are the highest level in Maslow's hierarchy, and refer to the realization of a person's potential, self-fulfillment, seeking personal growth and peak experiences. Unconditional positive regard. It means caring for the client but not in a possessive way or in such a way as simply to satisfy the therapist's own needs. It means caring for the client as a separate person, with permission to have his own feelings, his own experiences. Thanks for watching.